beautiful day after beautiful day deep divers. We are out here in the heart of nature. Look at this beautiful place. Let's breathe. Let's charge up deep divers. Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. I woke up like this, deep divers all magical and shit. Take that, take that, take that. Good ass energy, I'm sending you peace. Infinite waters, diving deep once again. Beautiful deep divers, another gorgeous day. Raising the frequency, you better be raising the vibration. I'm FaceTiming you right now, deep divers. If you are watching this video, something you really want is coming your way. All you gotta do is give thanks. Thank you universe, it's already here. Thank goodness for that. No, it's not though. No, it's not though. Deep divers, right? <laughs> Now, let's talk about this, deep divers. They were preparing you for the next one. Why people come and go in your life, deep divers, we got a whole lot to talk about. We got a whole lot to talk about because I received tons of messages like, Ralph, why didn't it work out with so-and-so? It all looked so good in the beginning, Ralph, but something happened. And I tell them, they were preparing you for the next one. They're like, what do you mean, Ralph? I'm like, I'm like, let me explain, okay? And we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello there? First and foremost, in the words of Ralph Smart, whoever is meant for you will never reject you. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. Say it again, Ralph. Whoever is meant for you will never reject you. Now, many times we are in a relationship and we sometimes wonder why it's not going the way we want. We sometimes scratch our head and say, wait a minute. This is not how I imagined it. This is not how I planned it in my head. Something, something just ain't right. We sometimes ask ourselves and question ourselves why it didn't work out. Because it all looked good. It all looked so good on paper, right, deep divers? Well, what if I told you that person you were with they were preparing you for the next one. Why people come and go in your life. We never meet people by accident. There is no such thing as a coincidence either. Everything is happening in divine order. Every single person that you meet in this lifetime it was written, maktub, that's the Arabic word, it was written. You were destined to meet that person. So therefore, be thankful you've had this opportunity to meet them, to learn from them, to grow with them, and to realize that it's not personal if it didn't work out, but they were preparing you for the next one. Because in life, we are constantly meeting new people to learn more about ourselves, to learn more about other people, to be thankful that actually, I'm a great being and some people are hurting, hurt people, hurt people. You just dodged a bullet and you don't even know. Sometimes you gotta be thankful Things didn't go according to plan because the universe saved you and protected you. It protected your ass. The universe protected you, deep divers, because down the road, if you had continued, it would have been ugly. You see, sometimes when things don't work out, the universe is actually saving you from people and places not meant for you. Mmm. What? Slow motion this side. Mmm. Be thankful, deep divers, and rejoice. You see, they were preparing you for the next one. Why people come and go in your life. Sometimes you're only supposed to meet people 
for a few seconds, for a few minutes, for a few days, for a few weeks, and that's it. For a few years, and that's it. Not for decades, Ralph. <laughs> you see, deep divers, there's a time for everything. And there's a beginning, and there's only ever a beginning. There is no such thing as an ending because just because both of you are not aligned, it doesn't mean that you will never be in alignment together. It just means the timing is not right for both of you to come together. And therefore the universe is like, hey, right now I'm preparing you for someone else that you're going to be in a greater alignment with. There are no endings, only new beginnings. That being you are with, they were preparing you for the next one. Sometimes, deep divers, have you been with someone who doesn't appreciate your magnificence, your greatness, your divine nature? They take you for granted. I wrote this down, deep divers. Those who handle stones will never know how to appreciate pearls. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. If they don't learn, if they can't learn to appreciate your presence, they're going to have to learn how to appreciate you in your absence. Deep divers, it's starting to feel like that old infinite waters again. We're out here in the heart of nature. How are you feeling today? They were preparing you for the next one. Why people come and go in your life. Whoever is meant to be with you will always gravitate back towards you. Don't cry that someone left. Be glad, rejoice, because the universe does not make mistakes. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. Everything is happening for a reason. And I told you, it's not over. You might come back together with that person in alignment, but it depends not just on where you are. It depends on where they are. Are they mature? Have they developed? Have they grown? Have they worked on themselves? You see, they were preparing you for the next one because you've upgraded, they haven't. You've worked on yourself, they haven't. Or maybe, maybe you have to work on yourself. Maybe you didn't deserve them, but we're gonna go with they didn't deserve you because that's usually the case, right? Right. <laughs> They didn't deserve your effort. They didn't deserve your peace and serenity. They didn't deserve that. But someone else will. They were preparing you for the next one because the next one you meet is going to honor you. They're going to respect you. They're going to massage your crusty ass toes and love you for it. <laughs> they were preparing you for the next one why people come and go in our life. You see, this is the great paradox. If you're in a relationship, if you are in a relationship with someone, you go through it, it's beautiful at the beginning, but then in the middle, there's some arguments, some disagreements. You really learn a lot about yourself and the other person. You see, truth be told, there is no such thing as a wasted experience. Everyone you meet, you've ever met, you've been with in a relationship is actually a teacher. They're teaching you about yourself. You're teaching them about themselves. So remind yourself, we are teaching each other. But with that new wisdom, they were preparing you for the next one so you don't make the same mistakes. They were, prepare, they, were, they were preparing you for the next one so you actually say, you know what? Now I know my true worth. They were preparing you for the next one to say, actually, this time, I'm not going to tolerate that BS. Put some respect on my name. <laughs> not everyone is worth your attention. Not everyone is worth 
the headache. Not everyone, if it's costing you your peace of mind, deep divers, it's too expensive. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. So I want to remind you, deep divers, if you've been with someone, if you are with someone right now, and something feels off, if you've left someone, they were preparing you for the next one. We aren't meeting people by accident. We're meeting people for a reason. We cross paths with people for a reason. And it's to know more about ourselves, it's to work on ourselves, it's to grow. It's to say, actually, I now know my worth and they were preparing you for the next one. And that's the gift. Sometimes you just got to say thank you, universe, because this person you were with that it didn't work out with, they're lost. They're going to be missing out. They're going to be saying, oh my gosh, I wish I, I, wish I was with Ralph. But too late. I've moved on. The cat down the road laughing over there. And that's why I'm just saying, feels so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Deep divers of planet Earth. Hit that like button. Share the video. Leave a comment down below of love and appreciation. Let's breathe. Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Go and check out the new book, Deep Divers, for more powerful, life-changing information just like this. Feel Alive by Ralph Smart on Amazon and at ralphsmart.com slash the book, the Bible of becoming your greatest version. Also, go and get the good ass prana shirts, Deep Divers, at ralphsmart.com slash clothes and spreadshirt.com if you're in America. And if you're a sexy ass model, whoa, you want to model the clothing? Well, go and buy some. Deep divers hurt people, hurt people. Sometimes you meet people and they act a certain way towards you, but how people treat us is not a reflection of how we are. It's a reflection of how they feel about themselves. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. A lot of people have big, big trauma. Issues, anger management issues, anger management issues, and it's got nothing to do with you. But guess what? They were preparing you. They were preparing you for the next one that's really going to appreciate you, honor you the way that you know you deserve to be honored and appreciated. And deep divers, I love all of you. Peace. Infinite waters, diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy. Peace. You! Once again, deep divers, hit that like button, share this video, leave a comment down below of gratitude and appreciation, and let me know how this video resonated with you. Were they preparing you for the next one, deep divers? Let me know. One love. Peace.